everyone, and that means this is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Michael Levine, who is Interim Executive Director of the Susan G. Komen Kansas City uh, Foundation, is here with us, and so we've got a race coming up on Saturday. Exactly, Cynthia. Thanks for having us. Our 25th anniversary race is wow. this Saturday. Yeah. Expo opens up at 2 o'clock. Races begin at 4 p.m. Should be a great day uh, to be out there and celebrate the breast cancer community. So let's talk about breast cancer and have there been advancements? What's the risk of a woman now? It used to be 1 in 9. Is it is it 1 in 8? 1 in 8 is, is a generic stat okay. that we work with that they will be diagnosed with breast cancer sometime in their lifetime. Uh, we know screening save lives, so the sooner you get screened at the right time, talking with your medical professional, we have a 99.9% .9 chance of survival if you get breast cancer caught before it spreads out of the breast. And as many people know, I am a breast cancer survivor. We're going on seven years now for me. Congratulations. Can you believe it was seven years Incredible. ago? So, I mean, that's one of the things that I really want to get across is the self exams are important too, the monthly self exams. Certainly. I found my cancer, I felt a lump uh, seven months after I had my mammogram. And so got right in and got treated and so here I am. So that's a big deal. Is that a push that the Komen's doing as well? Certainly, knowing your normal is probably one of our number one uh, things that we tell people is if you feel something, if you feel slightly off, talk to your medical professional and, and get exam. Also knowing your own personal family health history, that's a key component as well. So we've got to talk about the big mobile mammography unit. You guys are so proud of that. You've been doing a lot of work for, how long has it been on the road now? Uh, it's going on three years now. Yeah, our third year yeah. with Diagnostic Imaging Centers, right. and it's a wonderful partnership. It allows essentially the most cutting edge technology to come right to where individuals are at. Uh, we just re-upped our, our partnership with them. We'll have uh, about fifty dollars to $60,000 of additional funding available going into this next year. So and we're excited beautiful. to continue that. It comes straight to the people, you know, it goes straight to the, to the women who need exactly. the mammography. Exactly. We know that convenient. accessibility um, to appropriate health care is a huge challenge. And so if we can bring the unit for that important screening to them, that's key. So let's talk about the race. It's coming up. Where is it going to be? <laughs> you've got teams. You've got survivors. It is, uh, it's an incredible process to put together lots of great volunteers. Uh -huh. We're out at Black and Veatch on Saturday, October 6th. Mm -hmm. uh, again, the race venue opens up at 2 p.m., loads of additional parking. We have a pre-race concert uh, at 2.15 with the zeros uh, that will kick off our day. And uh, we're just excited to get out there and celebrate our survivor community. This is a special moment because for breast cancer survivors, we get out there and it's kind of like old home month, you know, where we, we get to see others that we've seen along the years. But, um, but for the people who are coming to support people that they've lost, or friends who are dealing with uh, a diagnosis of breast cancer, it's it's really an emotional moving moment to see that happen. It, it certainly is. It, it is a sisterhood and brotherhood because men get breast cancer also. Uh, and when they get together, even the survivor experience or the parade or even just getting, uh, you know, flowers at the finish line, uh, the emotion comes through with it's everybody it's, involved, whether you're a survivor, mm -hmm. co-survivor, just there to support the cause. Yeah, we've got to be together and we are. It shows it's just a united moment of everybody pushing for the same cause. Race for the cure. Love it. All right, Michael Levine, thanks so much Thank for coming you very and sharing. Much. Be sure and get out there and, and stop by and say hi if you see me there out walking on the race course on Saturday. Uh, race for the Cure. Thanks so much for coming. Thank you.